A major merger is now shaking up the banking industry. Capital One and Discover are joining forces. This announcement comes just as credit card debt soars to record highs. Here's ABC's Lionel Moise. This morning, a shakeup in the credit card industry. Capital One is buying Discover in a deal valued at $35 billion. Capital One is acquiring Discover, which is, is more than just a credit card issuer. They also have a card network over which the transactions are run. Uh, and they also have uh, accumulated a, a pretty significant deposit base, bringing in deposits from consumers uh, and making loans other than just uh, credit cards. Joining forces will give Capital One access to Discover's payment network, collecting fees to better compete against Visa and MasterCard, which could benefit customers in the long run. It comes as credit card debt in the U.S. hits a record high. The average balance now tops $6,000. And with high interest rates, delinquencies are up among all age groups. 49% of credit card holders now carry debt from month to month. The increase in credit card debt at a time when credit card rates are north of 20% uh, at record highs themselves, that really illustrates the financial strain that millions of households are feeling just trying to make ends meet. Uh, as savings balances were run down, we've seen credit card balances run up. More people are carrying balances for longer periods of time. Could a merger like this with two big credit companies have an impact on that? For consumers that are grappling with high balances and high interest rates, uh, this combination isn't going to do anything to change that, particularly in the short term. So focus on paying down that debt as quickly as possible. Makes your financial life easier. Bankrate says any changes in the terms of your credit card must be communicated 45 days in advance. Experts say paying down your debt and increasing your credit score will put you in a better position to take advantage of any potential perks after the merger. Lionel Moyes, ABC News, New York.